I know the guy. You know what it is. The guy's obsessed with me. When he doesn't hear me, he uh, he bitches. When he does hear me, he claims uh, I'm doing this to the channel. You got you got to love it, man. Well, that's it. You know, he doesn't. Uh, you know, he doesn't realize, or he's too stupid, or cracked up, or doped up to realize people have jobs out here. You know, we don't have time to be out here on the radio morning, noon, and night, getting high like he does. Yeah, I'm gonna do something, uh, bad boy. I'm gonna. You seen a new toy I picked up, right? Yeah, just a couple unboxings you gotta check out, but uh, you see my carrier now in audio, right? Yes, sir. Uh, we got God damn it, what's happening now? Alright, alright, one, two. How about a bad boy? Did you notice any difference? One, two, one, two. Audio drive. Yeah, you went from the 10, you went from the 10, now you're on the plus. Alright, that's about the same as uh, my two pill, more or less, about the same. Yeah, there's a little baby, uh, little baby Thunderbolt 305 I picked up, man. Pristine condition, man. Um, unbelievable. When I picked it up, it was uh, like hitting the jackpot. Oh, man, nice, man. Fucking 305. I used to have one. I used to have one, man. I never got rid of that. Good amp. Good amp all around, man. <laughs> yeah, I tell you, man, this little thing, I, I tell you, I don't know how the guy kept it. Like, Well, he restores. The guy restores amps, and uh, when I seen it, I just had to have it, man. And uh, this is the only one I seen like it. You know, he had an, another one for sale, but this one, this one has the original meter, um, and it has the fan. You know, because he has another one for sale, but nothing like this. This this thing is pristine. When I tell you, you know how I am, and I know the way you are with with scuffs, scratches, and whatnot. Thing don't even have a scuff mark on it, and the inside. The metal is shiny, like uh, like it came out the factory. And I got tubes for it, you know, the uh, 6MJ6. Not the 6LQ6, there's a difference. People don't know the difference if they don't know tubes. The 6MJ6 are the heavy duty versions of the uh, 6LQ6 or 6E, 6J, I forget the other number. But they're, they're compatible as far as pinout, but uh, the 6MJ6 are much more durable tube. Yes, yes they are, yes they are. Yeah, I'm familiar with them. Yeah, let me tell you, man. Don't get rid of that box. Hold on to that, man. That's, that's you got it like that, man. Hold on to that bad boy. Yeah, they're hard to come by. I was going to get one of those. About a couple of, a couple of years back, I saw one, man. This guy had it, papers, the box, and everything. I was like, damn, yeah, I should jump on it. But then I was like, ah, let's just let it go, man. I got too much fucking equipment over here. But that's a good box, man. A real good box. Yeah, Roger. Yeah. Yeah, I got this thing. Believe it or not, I'm driving it with the uh, 2547, you know, the little Galaxy base. And I'm just driving it with a watt, the way I have it set up. And, uh, you know, I got this thing, uh, I got this thing pumping, man. You know, it's not pumping a lot out. It's basically a baby driver, I call it. But, uh, yeah, you, you know what it is then. It's a little Thunderbolt 305, man. And I just uh, picked up some tubes, man. Brand new. NOS, new old stock, brand new in the box. I got about 12 tubes I picked up recently. And uh, brand new tubes I got yesterday in the mail, which I uh, did an unboxing for uh, for Cracky. So he claims the tubes are going for 100 a piece, but uh, little does he know how wrong he is. But yeah, it's it's nice, man. This thing is uh, doing it more or less, uh, maybe a, about the same as my uh, Dave made two pill. But, uh, you know, obviously with, with tubes, you're going to get a, a cleaner sound less distortion so on and so forth you know and the sweet tubes man so uh you know the deal real deal holy feel man that's all i gotta say i'm glad i got this like i said if it wasn't a condition that it was in i wouldn't even touch it but uh this thing has looked like you got it from the factory unbelievable how mint it is I i'll send you some photos when i have a chance i'll send you some a <laughs> hundred dollars my fucking six oh two six is and they're the, 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 you know, Sylvania, Sylvania tubes, all right? 
those shits cost you know, 125 a piece. So those those are stronger. So those are definitely gonna be like in the 150 range, maybe more. Yeah, that's about good. He said Thunderbolt 305. Yeah, Roger that. Yeah, I got Pedro Marrera out there crying. Yeah. Yeah, this thing is mint, man. Like I said, uh, this thing, I got it tweaked nice, you know? And I got uh, all kind of replacement parts for it, you know, for the power supply and stuff. So, uh, you know, if ever in the future, if an electrolytic cap goes on it, I have full replacements. Including, the, uh, including a couple of transistors with the TO50 style case, you know, with the round little metal case with the three legs. I even have replacements for that, so, you know, I, I'll have this thing for a long time. This is definitely uh, a collector's, uh, collector item, and uh, it's collecting, I, I should say collector's uh, style, or should I say, when you look at it, man, it looks like a museum piece. You put this in the, in the glass, man, it's like, damn, that's a collector's piece, you know? But uh, the thing is talking, man, you hear it, I'm using it, and, uh, I got a couple of boys out there, extremely envious and jealous. You know, little Pedro out there in Crackhead 127. The boys are extremely irate when I uh, key up at this little box. I call it the little lightning box, you know. Of course, uh, what comes from the sky? What comes from a thunderstorm? A thunderbolt. How many? How many lightning bolts? 305. <laughs> And uh, like I said, I actually had to, uh, I actually had to open up the 2547 to back down the the dead key, the the you know the low power, to one watt. Cause I was getting about two, two and a half, and the high end was about 12. So I backed it down from one watt to about eight, maximum with the radio. Cause uh, you know and the way I have it tuned, you know, I tuned everything, all three controls, and which is cool with this amp, it even has a separate power knob. So I keep that about 12 o'clock, so, you know, I basically got the thing uh, low dead key and just have it swing so you get that, that maximum audio potential and you're not overdriving anything. All right, no problem. It's good hearing you, man. Yeah, I'm going to put on the side. I got to get ready for the salt mine here. And uh, a couple of things I got to do. But I know when I when we unkey, the boy's going to be crying. I think uh, Pedro's in Brooklyn today. He's uh, been uh, going to Brooklyn lately. You know, you know uh, the truck yard over there. So it's all good. All right, you do what you got to do, man. And uh, I'm going to put it on the rack for now and uh, finish doing what I got to do, get ready for the salt mine. And I'm going to have the gates rolling. You know what it is, Enforcer 250, somewhere around the lower deck with my little Thunderbolt 305, my little lightning box. And I just got down. 10 4, man. Definitely, man. 73, man. Be safe out there and we catch on the rebound. With that, I'm off the key. I've been on the dead here. I've been out on the kitchen. Listen to me. I'm a crash boat. I'm snoring away. And, you know, I... <laughs> Audio. Did he just say he's snorting away? You hear him? You can't make this up, Eddie. You can't make it up. His own words. He's snorting away. Oh, 912 units, so I don't know. I... Yeah, man. I just sit back and laugh at the whole thing, man. It's funny as hell. But anyway, it's morning entertainment. Morning time, morning wave. Good morning. Roger that. Good morning. How's this little Thunderbolt sounding, Eddie? How's this little 305 sounding? Sounds good. Sounds good. I mean, I'm right here. Big Apple side. He's pinning me, but it sounds good. Yeah, no, on the carrier wise, I know I'm, I'm, I'm what I'm doing. I'm just saying the audio. As long as it sounds clear, that's all that matters. All right, no, no problem. You have a, a good, uh, good morning, Eddie, and uh, safe trip. I'll be on the side, man. I got finished getting ready here for work, so I'm gonna put it on the rack. And uh, good morning, everyone out there in Foster 250, somewhere around the lower deck that I just got down. 
Yeah, I don't even know where where Big Bird was, man. I tell you what, that's the reality. And uh, you know, I just uh, copied it and I pasted it on the Enforcer's uh, page there just to show, like he's claiming that I'm in Brooklyn. We'll see it again today. Good day, good day. I liked it. I liked it.
working and talking and working and talking and working and talking. It's looking for you. I heard 38 minute rap of you. Good morning, Danny Boy, Dark Side of the Moon. 
Crush. Crush. What I miss? What I miss? Crush. Nice and quiet out there. Where I like it. Junkie monkey free. Storytelling free. Crush, no more crybabies. Crush, wipe the tears. Wipe the tears. Tears for fears. Wasn't that a song, Tears for Fears? Or was that a group? Oh, look at that, look at that. My little thunderbolt. A whole lot of lightning bolts coming out that little box. Oh, yeah. Look at that, look at that. Oh, tears, <coughs> tears for fears. Right. Holding back the tears. <laughs> Look at that, my little thunderbolt. You gotta love it, man. So, so jealous and envious. But check out the, my latest unboxing, man. You see those beautiful brand new tubes in a box that they claim I can't get. You gotta love it, man. Oh, yeah, jealousy and envy. It'll get you nowhere. Hey, pickup truck. I'm not even Ain't no pickup truck out here. Oh, yeah. Look at that. All you hear is 250. All you hear is 250 with this little lightning box. Thunderbolt 305, and I just get down. Anyway, and this junkie is on. Oh, oh yeah, the only junkie out there is Crackhead 127 and 206. The only junkie boys. Oh, yeah, look at that, look at that. Crush. Can you see it? Can you see it? Crush. Ain't no hillbilly. Ain't no rednecks out here. It's just 250. Oh, yeah, the strong arm of the law. Look at that, look at that, and I just got down. Black Hawk don't hear you right now unless you're in the Big Apple. Unless you're right there near the boy's house, Black Hawk don't hear you. Let him know, Black Hawk. Let him, Let him know, Black Hawk. I, I, I'll go right near his window, Black Hawk. <laughs> Do you hear him now, Black Hawk? What a fucking retard. Stupid fuck. He's going to go right near the man's crib and say, Oh, do you hear him now, Black Hawk? Yeah, if you're under the man's window, of course I'm not gonna, he's not going to hear me, you retard. I'm not next to the guy. I'm not near him. It's how stupid these idiots are. You know what it is? It's, you know, sitting on their prostate all day. You know, they get delusional. Everybody, the party! Crush, you don't hear that fool. You don't hear that fool. Like B.A. Barakas would say, I pity the fool. <laughs> like B.A. Barakas would say from the A-team, I pity the fool. Uh, uh, yeah, unless Manhattan is not in the middle of... Unless, remember B.A. Barakas from the A-Team, I pity the fool. You don't know his location, stupid. I pity the fool. Remember that, B.A. Barakas? <coughs> you remember that. Remember the A-Team? The A-Team with uh, Mr. T? I pity the fool. <laughs> we all remember the A-Team, right? He ran that uh, we all we all remember the A team. I pity the fool. Yeah, who try to step on me? <laughs> Just ain't happening. Bring to that party. Should I bring some Heineken? Should I bring some? Yeah, this is this, this homo talking about parties. Look at this. He wants a party with men. Unbelievable. You just can't make this up. Black Lives Window. Shut up, stupid. Roger on that. Does he want? Now you know. You know. I'm gonna just ignore you. Hey, uh, pick up your mark. I'm ignore you. I'm gonna put you on pay no mind list because uh, you're boring, man. I know you want to be on my show, you want to be a star, but you know what? I'm not going to give you that attention. I'm just going to put you in a pay-no-mind list. Crush! You sound like you're in the bathroom. Sound like you shit yourself. But anyway, let's move on to better, bigger and better things. Uh, how's this 305 sound, man? It's my little baby lightning box. Oh, yeah. Look at that, look at that. And I just get down. He might be scrubbing his back, getting ready for... Oh, yeah. It's about that time... About that time, I got to be getting out of here in a little while, in a few minutes. Oh yeah, I hope everyone likes this morning show. I'm out here to provide truth and justice and crush these wannabes, these wannabe tough guys out here. You know, there ain't no tough guy Tuesday out here, a bunch of homos. With some rhymes for that party, for that big party. You got bridge talkers, you got Pedro over here, you got Pedro and his uh, lucky boyfriend over there, and uh, where is he over there in Brooklyn? Yeah, little crackhead one two seven. They, I don't know why. Yeah, you know, they all they all jump in front of the crackhead. I guess they feel sorry for him. You know what I mean? They pity him. Taking some. Uh, I was thinking about. You know, but not me. I don't pity the fool. I slap him up, man. You got to do yours. You got to do you, man. Now you know we're gonna support you anymore. Not with John, Donald J. Trump in office. 
all those entitlements are bye bye. That's it. You gotta you gotta walk on your two feet now. No more sitting back and uh, sleeping all day, Cracky. You gotta go uh, look for that job. No more entitlements. No, no, no. Oh yeah, you gotta go out there and get a job, Cracky. You know, get move. You know, push a broom or collect bottles and cans. Do something, man. But uh, sitting home all day, Cracky. That's not gonna not gonna work with Donald J. Trump. He's gonna make America great again, and I'm gonna make 19 great again. I guarantee. Those entitlement days are gone, man. You lazy boys out there, crackhead like 127, those days are gone, man. No more EBT, no more bomber phone. That's history. <laughs> you know, and uh, you see how the crackhead smokes all day. You see how Richard smokes his crack in K2 all day and gets high, sleeps all day. That's going to come to a, a drastic end, guarantee. Party at Black Hawk House, party! You know, that's going to come to an end, I guarantee it. Yeah, I only go, I only go to Black Hawk's house. You know, that, that's going to come to an end. But, uh, you know, it is what it is, man. You know, that's why I work seven days a week. I do doubles, you know, because uh, I put in the time, man. But, you know, I get highly rewarded. I make that stupid paper. That's why they're so envious of my career and the money I make. Six, six digits, man. These boys are very irate. It's right now. But don't hate on another man with a man possesses what he makes in his career. Don't, don't hate on me. <coughs> I understand how very hateful these cacks are. These little jealous little bitches out there. Very jealous and irate. I don't even hear Cracky, man. That recording taking Cracky right out of my radio, man. You know that bridge recording? I don't even hear the junkie anymore since that recording came on. Oh, yeah. Uh, you know, it's it's a pleasure because it's like a filter to me. You know, I don't hear it. I don't hear that boy when that uh, recording comes on. That's a good thing about that bridge recording. 12 foot, 1 inch. Oh, yeah. Stay alert, guys. Stay alert. Good morning, Johnny Rack. Twelve with a twelve foot one inch. Be careful, man. Don't hit that. Don't hit that roof. Don't get wedged under there. Hey, good morning, Acom. Good morning, man. How's everything? I hear you, man. I hear you. Yeah, it's just you know. Hey, it is what it is. You got to make it good. You know what I mean, Acom. You can't let life get to you, man. You gotta make what's bad, you gotta turn it to good, you know what I mean? He's my voice. Yeah, I know. He's like <coughs> you gotta make the best out of what you have, and you gotta do more with less. That's my model. That's been my model uh, ever since I've been on radio over 30 years. I do more with less. That's why I got this radio running one watt. One watt. Uno watt. One watt into my little Thunderbolt 305. That's it. Just a single watt. The radio is barefoot driving this little lightning box. That's all I got. That's all we got, Alcon. You repeated it. You know what I mean, Alcon? Now, you don't want to hear Pedro Marrera. Right now, Alcon, all you hear is 250. Let him know. Yeah, 250. Roger that. Thank you very much. Hey, Johnny Rat, I try to get that message to you, man. Richard spreading rumors that uh, me and you had met, so. I think you should clean the air when you have a chance. Tell, uh, tell uh, 127, stop spreading rumors like that. And if we did meet, that's not a bad thing, you know? But he's trying to make it like, uh, you know, we had an eyeball and I was terrified that she didn't knock me out. So I, I know he was delusional when he said that. I know he didn't mean it. But, uh, yeah, the boy is just starting uh, stupid rumors. You have a good morning there, Johnny Rapatro. Drive safe, everyone out there. God bless. Have a good morning, good afternoon. Oh, yeah. Stay dry. They call me 250, somewhere around the lower deck. I got to get out of here, guys. It's about that time. My partner going to pick me up in a couple. And God bless everyone. God bless America. Once and for all. They call me Enforcer 250. Check out my latest unboxing videos. And I guarantee you'll be happy. With my little Thunderbolt 305. Oh, yeah. No big box. No big tubes. Just my little baby driver. That's what I call it. See, when I say baby driver, I'm referring to the Thunderbolt 305 in case... Uh, Pedro's ears are full of potatoes because uh, Baby Driver and 305 Thunderbolt's equivalent. The same box I'm talking about. And when I say barefoot radio, it's one watt driving that unit. Because I have to be very specific with clowns out there because they can't comprehend. Anyway, take care. 73 Enforcer 250 if you like what you hear. 
Check me out on Foster Space 250 on YouTube, Monday through Friday, 5 a.m. 5 a.m. to 6 a.m. Excluding holidays, weekends, and uh, when I do my doubles, uh, you know, sometimes I uh, can't have the show, you know. Preference, uh, priorities on my J-O-B. You know, got to make that uh, six-digit figure, so got to work hard for my money, you know what I mean? Who used to say that? Uh, was it Diana? Donna Summers? You got to work hard for your money. Oh, yeah. I got to go, guys. 7-3, Enforcer 250, somewhere around the lower deck. Till next time, Alcon, Johnny Rapacho, everyone out there, all my friends and fans, 7-3, Enforcer 250, somewhere around the lower deck. And I just got down. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Let me uh, let me not finish. Let me not uh, end it without saying don't despair. Of course, 250 will always be out there. God bless everyone. God bless America. 7-3, 250, clear. Wow, what a wrap. God bless everyone. Now they could talk about me, Yacon. Now they could talk about me because when I'm gone, that's all these boys do. They're, they're very irate and they uh, they love enforcer. That's why I have a five star show. God bless. I'm off the key. I'm not going to respond to the rhetoric, but they could talk about me all they want. Enforcer two five zero off the key seven three.